you have given the exams from both the institutes iei as well as ifoi there is a huge myth iei is challenging even you had that feeling that how will it be possible iei is very tough the results are devastating but as professors we know that there is no difference between both the institutes a student with solid prep can clear the exam from any institute under any circumstances under any challenging to challenging paper so what do you feel is the difference between both the institutes and in the recent time our home grown institute has made some rapid revamps in the curriculum in the centers in the automation in the uh, operations in the marketing so what do you suggest to our viewers and how can you differentiate between the two institutes to have an informed decision right so uh, i appeared for my first six papers from the uk institute which is ifoa and then in 2022 i shifted from ifoa to iei and took all my exemptions into iei now the reason my reason was very different that it was in 2022 iei had three attempts so i could easily clear more papers because i would be getting more opportunities plus the exam dates suited me better keeping in mind my ca exams as well but as a difference between the institutes there is not much of a difference honestly both have their pros and cons and i think at the end of it both balance out so for example ifom currently they are conducting online examinations there is a lot of issues regarding plagiarism collusions people uh, getting banned from the institute and i would not say that everyone is correct but there are many innocent people as well who have to bear the brunt of it online exams open book exams of course this risk is always there also ifoi since it has tra transformed into open book examinations the kind of questions they have been asking in the exams has seen a massive change so if we go through the previous years papers and compare it with pre pandemic and post pandemic we can see that it has become much more application based rather than book work iii on the other hand since it has turned back into offline mode of examination and there has proper proctoring iii has still the book work element as well as some application based it is true that iii standard of the papers was higher earlier but as of now i would never say that iii is tougher or ifo is tougher i would rank both of them equally you need the same amount of prep for ifoa as well as iii the only difference being is iii you have to know the concept more in depth as an institute i have seen that it focuses more on solid knowledge rather than just knowing the curriculum it tests your base it tests your awareness especially in the higher level papers like cp1 sa7 sp5 you have to be aware of what is happening in the world as of now rather than just what is written in the book which as a professional i would say is more important than knowing and just uh, remembering what is there in the book